Hey, this is Sapphire Chow, and welcome back to another Chow Garden Let's Play episode season two of all that jazz. We have ourselves a slightly different episode today, and I will show you exactly what's been going on. So, we've got some different Chow here. We have Chow from the community. Hey, or, um, yeah, that's right. We have ourselves some guest Chow from that you guys have uh, submitted, which was really awesome. So thank you so much for those who did. This is Yami, very lovely with a little little custom uh, bow there as well as one of its hats. We also have ourselves all days, <laughs> day to day to day. That's a nice face you got there. Um, who else do we have? We have uh, Zazoom. Now you might not also notice this swim set is actually pretty, uh, pretty high actually. Um, I believe that is the Question mark swim. Uh, no, it is the X ranking. So um, that is a special X ranking that is pretty new in Chowwood Extended Version 8, which I've yet to show off. So uh, Zazoom is one of them. I have rebalanced some of these Chow stats because um, most guest Chow generally have uh, 2,000 in their stats. So I'm going to say, oh, and this is this is Chicky right here. Um, very adorable Chow, armless uh, chicken Chow. I absolutely love it. They're, they're a, a very cute, and of course, we can tell that they too also have a little boat. See, so it's cheeky. Very good at flying as well. Um, and speaking of, we have big janky Furatio. Some of you might remember from uh, this live stream that we did. Oh, hey, oh. Yeah, he's doing a bit of a dance. Let's just let's see if anyone else is joining with that. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, so I'm sure that we'll get, we'll get a few little fun things done today. Namely, uh, races and all that kind of stuff. Um, who's having a pool party here? We have Jester as well, joining in. And let's see, we've got, we got a pretty full garden here. Oh yes, we haven't seen you yet. Um, if I can pick you up. We have Luma as well. Oh, you already finished dancing. Alright. Oh, well it looks like someone's gonna try out the box. The RNG box? Yep. We haven't seen the Chow in the season yet to actually try the RNG box, so let's see... No, they haven't been spared. I apologize. <laughs> uh, they got the spook. Alright, let's see, there must be some other Chow around here. Oh, there's one up here. Um, looks like I'll wake them up. This is uh, Tiburon, again another Chow that has uh, an X ranking in Swim. Uh, I know you're tired, but uh, I'm going to take you briefly to the uh, kindergarten just to show that off as well. Um, yeah, they get this very special fruit that uh, makes a chow have make the S ranking go to an X. And yes, I still have the uh, <laughs> uh, I still have the Google Translate mod enabled. Yeah, there's the X rank. <laughs> Just saw the kind of technology is just the tip. That's right. All the um, all the Chow's uh, stats or typings have also been translated. I probably need to check that as well for all the different Chow typings, because oh my god. <laughs> uh, private part no. Dear War, I love you. <laughs> okay. Oh, this is gonna be adorable. Um, I also forgot to get to mention that, that uh, zero deaths have been caused as well as zero panties thanks to this chow. Okay, cool. Yeah, that's fine. That's all good. That is fine. That is fine. But yeah, that's gonna be. I feel like I feel like that Google Translate mod is just gonna be the gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> I believe that's all the chow we have in this garden, but uh, we aren't done yet. We do have another load of chow. Oh, here, cheeky. Look at them fly. Alright, uh, just to make sure there's any other chow up here. Nope. A lot of them are sleeping, so... Let's, uh, let's go to the dark garden. Uh, there are no guests in the hero garden, I did check. I did move the rest of the others in the dark garden here. We have ourselves, uh, Mint. A two-tone, look like two-tone, uh, green, probably... I'm just thinking like sky blue, I think. Yeah, sky blue two-tone. Totally knew that. And we also have another, we have another green yep. lad here. Alpine. Very shiny and very cute. Yes, yes. Uh, who else do we have? We have ourselves yep. Tub Junior as well joining us. And 
And of course, Soul with their very soulful face. A very, a very cursed face, I feel like. A cute and cursed face. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> uh, and then we have an invisible lad here, Ultima. Who's also joined us here. So yeah, I think that's, I think that is everyone. Yeah, that looks about, that looks about right. So, um... Oops, I didn't mean to pick that up. I want to pick this one up and give you a thing because you're hungry. There you go. So we got a selection of happy babs all from the community. So again, thanks all who did send through a guest chow. And one thing I would like to do is uh, show off their their skills, essentially. Um, in a chow race. And now I'm getting just distracted by the fact that this chair is distracted by balls. <laughs> actually, there's just a lot of things just going on at the moment. Oh, hey -o. Has this? I don't think we're actually showing this off, but uh, free eggs. That's a thing. Um, I don't know what the timing is for that. I don't know if it's right after they finish airing or before or after. I don't know. But yeah, free eggs. I want to see if that comes, actually comes up now. Because it is a limited time when that actually comes up and I yet to actually trigger that event like only once I think. Alright, to the squat mart. No, nope, it didn't, didn't seem to do anything. But yeah. Dude, the aviators look freaking nice. Um, no alcohol. Yep, no alcohol indeed. Alright then. Without further ado, let's go do some racing. So we got ourselves a few different chow here. Oh yeah, come Hugo, I forgot to mention that. We also have that chow. Alright, I like the fact that Final's still appearing in these. And a few other different chow. And somehow Snake is here. Alright, let's go. Cool. Um, you know what, we're gonna make it a diamond race. Now I believe I do have mods enabled to limit the penalty from the Jack in the Box as well as the puzzle. So that hopefully should make a slightly more equal, even level playing field. Because all these Chow's stats I have rebalanced to be essentially the same. So now it's just up to the gods of the RNG to really determine who shall be victorious. So yes, anyone's game at the moment. But you know what, that's always the case at the beginning of this race here. Um. Alright, just those guys. Alright, Yami in first place, followed by Chicky. Uh, and then we have Mint and Luma. I take no responsibility if any chair happens to trip on accident because, you know, that's just the R way the RNG goes. Alright, they are approaching the puzzle area, but of course no one should care about the puzzle because I have disabled that. The puzzle is now illegal. The puzzle is silly. It is a silly place. Yeah, see? No, no one cares about the puzzle. No one should care about the puzzle because it's because it's dumb. I haven't yet to see, yet to see any trips though. And then I don't want to speak too soon because it's, it's bound to happen, but uh... Yeah, uh, Yummy and Mint, pretty close. 
And then followed by Luma. But come on, we need to get someone to do us proud and do a full potato and trip. You know, because that's, that's, that's just, just tradition, you know. We need our... Maybe the mandatory choke zone will deliver for us. Oh, and then Chicky. <laughs> I just, oh yeah, I just realized Chicky still has a really awesome um, fly stat. But I did nerf their power to balance that out. Alright, now we're approaching the mandatory choke zone. Oh, Chicky must have tripped. Damn. Alright, well here we are. Final stretch into the, the death pits towards the mandatory choke zone. Let's see who's going to take it out in this uh, this wave. Of oh, Yummy! And then Mint just overtook Chicky there. Well then. Interesting turn of events. We have Furosho. Where, where's D? D? D to D? 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 You must, have got, you, must have, you, must, you must have tripped, I think. You must have got tripped and then they got boxed as well. There we are. Bring it home there. E. Hey, good work, guys. Alright, with our next round of chow that we are going to be facing, we have ourselves Alpine, Tub Junior, Soul, Ultima, and we have some special guests Zach, 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 and an uh, empty slot. <laughs> Because I just thought we we don't we don't have a full uh, enough to make two full rounds of other chow and way uh, early chokes hail, so yes we got we got we have a Zach just throw, being thrown in just for shenanigans. I don't think they should be that good anyway because their stats aren't that best. So these chow should easily overtake Zach, both of them, all three of them essentially. Yeah, see look at that. <laughs> so there you go, guest appearance from from Zach himself or himself. Yeah. How he's changed since season one. <laughs> but yes, um, yeah, we have ourselves, uh, who's in first? Uh, well, no, Zach, it says Zach's in first, but you know, he's, he's, he's never first. He, he should never win this sort of race, and I'd be very surprised if he does. Um, we have Tub Jr. and Alpine uh, doing pretty well, followed by Soul and Ultima, the invisible lad. So yes, yeah, pretty, pretty, pretty close between these three. You have to see any chokes, but you know that could always change. And 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 and, the, and eighth place is the empty slots just hanging there by looks of it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, soul just making it as another trip for us. We've got two of Ultima's chairs, Ultima and Soul, uh, not nicely bunching together, uh, you know, chilling out. Um, we got Top Junior doing pretty well, as well as Alpine, so again, it is still anyone's game, with thanks to the mandatory choke zone, and that is- Oh! There's another choke, thanks to, uh, Soul. Soul seems to be the MVP when it comes to tripping. So thank you for that. I, do I don't have a trip counter, but I would gladly add that to our trip counter, if I was keeping track of that. <laughs> Okay, can they maintain this lead? Because all it takes is the pits of death, and they can change everything. Pits of death? Pits of death! Alpine! Alpine also gets pits of death! And then we have Ultima. Who gets the pits of death and then Soul takes the third place? <laughs> oh, there we go. And then we have Zack, um, and, and Zack, and, uh, Zack. Alright, which, which, which one's gonna be next place? I think it might be Zack. Oh! Well, Zack just forgets to fall in the pits of hell, that's fine. Oh, beautiful. Chokes just before a pit, right? 
Oh no, you dodged the pits. Okay, that's all good. We all good there. And if, but there, of course the real winner here was Empty Slot. Because there was only seven chow racing. <laughs> Alright, for our third race, I want to do something a little bit different this time. And I want to verse Tiburon and Zazoom both together because they both do have X rankings in their swim. And I think it would be good to see them really shine in that particular way. And I think a Aquamarine race, I think, is... We, 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 we need an Aquamarine race just to mix things up instead of a Diamond race all the time. So... Let's see who truly is the best X-ranked swimmer. And yes, we have uh, those two, Tiburion and Zazoom, as well as uh, a, like a six empty slots. So let's see if they can beat empty slot Chow and prove themselves worthy. Slightly in front with there's Zoom. Actually, Zazoom I think was like the most, like the strongest chow that was probably given to me because they had uh, all S, I think. They had, very, like, they had like 2,700 sort of stats. Um, which again was very overpowered compared to the other chow that I received. So that's why I sort of made it a bit different in terms of the 2,000 stats. But yeah, still, still anyone's game. Still anyone's game. That is... They're neck on neck. All it takes is... Oh! I was just like, the pathing could change everything. Trips could change anything. Oh. Oh, yep. Zazoom got that one. But that, that was, again, very, very, very close. And wanted to actually, you know, give, them, give some time to shine with their really awesome swim stat. Now we've got all the chow in the chow garden. <laughs> and oh lordy, that's a lot of children here. Look at them all. Doing things. How are you not drowning? Now you're you alright, you'll be fine. How many of them actually like Sonic? Yeah, quite a few of them actually. Alright, they're all gonna assault Sonic in these best clothes ever. <laughs> yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yep. Right, let's, let's, let's all get them swimming. Alright, I, I demand there be a uh, pool party. Alright, I'm gonna have to get you here, in here, Alpine. You in here. Uh, go with your swim chow. You need to join us, Tub Junior. And who else is there? Oh yes, and Zazoom. Good job with the racing. Everyone's having a pool party. Except for that one chow that's designed to sleep in the water instead. Hey. And this won't be our only guest dedicated episode. Uh, I will want to do some more future ones down the track as well. So maybe whenever we reach a, uh, whenever we reach like a little milestone, there's it is episode ten. So maybe twenty or thirty or something along those lines. Whenever, whenever I feel like, uh, yeah, we might we might do that. But I'll let you guys know in advance when we when when that does happen again. Um, I just want to check, is there any chow? Oh, there's some chow still sleeping. Okay, we all come Hugo's sleeping. Uh, any chow up here? Sometimes they spawn up here. Nope, we're good. We're good. Alright. Uh, look at them. Look at them all. Alright. Um, I also want to make a, uh, a little bit of a question for you guys. Um, for those who remember my first season, I asked for a, uh, an unused colour chow egg. And I think we went with uh, uh, Powder Blue for Hazard. Um, and this time around, I would like to request a new colour. So, I'm thinking maybe a shiny chow, but I want to ask you guys, should we go with a deep blue chow or a darker grey shiny chow? So, 
Uh, I'll leave that to you guys uh, to decide uh, because I believe those colors we still can't really get. I mean, we might be able to get through breeding, but we can't really get directly from the black market. So I'm thinking of doing that uh, just to show off those unused colors again, uh, which will be just for a bit of fun there. So yeah, I'll leave that with you guys. Another thing I'd also like to make a special mention is, again, there was a lot of awesome art that came about, which I did miss, unfortunately, from the past episode. So I want to make sure, I want to give them the recognition that it deserves, because I absolutely love it. Um, so we had some amazing uh, fan art of Ceiling and Rush, thanks to Kit Pancake. Um, Pulsar getting more love, thanks to a small one with a sandcastle, was absolutely adorable. Um, and Pulsa and Doot having a nice, lovely conversation, thanks to uh, Six-Tailed Madness. And another thing I absolutely love is uh, the garbage boy himself with uh, the trashy boy himself, Trash. It's like Trash is taking him under his wing, and I feel like that's, that's pretty adorable. I love that, and thanks so much for that, Shady. Um, I think it's going to be a matter of time before I have a chow named Rubbish that will just, like, complete the holy trinity of, uh, of, of garbage chow, really. <laughs> So, yeah, that's that's going to be a thing, eventually. Not now, but it will be, I'm, I'm pretty sure. Oh, hey, you're awake. I didn't get the chance to pick you up and say hello. Oh, he's a happy boy. That's yeah, good to know. Oh, now you're awake too. Taburon? Okay. Ah, oh, Furatio. A janky boy is uh, singing, so... They, I, th I think they deserve an audience. Oh, is that Chicky being fabulous? Oh, that is fabulous. You can join, join the... Or you can just contribute singing as well. <laughs> and you know what, with all that in mind... I think now's a good time for us to perhaps finish things up here. So, I want to thank you all so much for watching. Uh, next episode, we will definitely, you'll be definitely seeing all my other chow. Um, probably do a bit of raising. I have a very special thing in mind for uh, garbage, actually. I've got a very special uh, plan in mind for that. So that will be probably what we'll do for our next episode. So with uh, Gammy doing some graffiti on the ground, I'll sign off here. So this has been Sapphire Chow and I am over and out.